excited like literally I'm excited and nervous I'm always kind of nervous to meet new people I'm always like oh are they gonna be nice and all that stuff but we're gonna figure it out so I hope you enjoyed the little mini montage of me doing my makeup and all that stuff I am a bit late I think no actually I'm not I'm like 30 minutes early which is great and I'm still about 23 minutes away so yeah so um, I'm gonna try to vlog as much as possible we're gonna see all right I'll see you there bye, -bye.
burn anyone's eyes. Oh. Hi, my name is Jax from Jax Sanchez TV, and I'm so excited to be here with you guys tonight to host the first Face Australia and New Zealand show. It's yeah. excited. Yeah. And I want the show to be super interactive, so I'm breaking that fourth wall, and I want everyone to cheer and clap. Come on, give it up. Oh. Please welcome Sydney makeup artist, Becca Gilmartin. Yeah. <laughs> Please give it up for celebrity makeup artist and beauty writer Dean Nixon. <laughs> Please give a very warm welcome to the fabulous Brooke Lowe. <laughs> Please welcome the artistic and very edgy Tarek Dasarovic. <laughs> for international makeup artist and influencer, Christina Sicalia! Oh, Hi, my name is Courtney Holland. You might know me from Instagram as Courtney Lee Holland. I'm from Western Australia, from a little town called Dawesville that's oh, surrounded by like water. Jenna Marbles. Face Awards have always been Whoa. the ultimate dream of mine. I actually wanted to move to America just to be a part of Face Awards. So when they brought it to Australia and New Zealand, I couldn't pass on the chance to just host it. When you found out Face Awards is coming to Australia? Um, to be honest, I tried multiple times to find a way to enter the US yeah. one. We were about <laughs> five years straight. Um, so when I found out that it came to Australia and New Zealand, I was ecstatic. I started planning my entry from day The off. biggest highlight during the Face Awards experience has definitely been meeting other YouTubers. Like, to actually have a community and not just be like by myself in my room all the time. I'm like, yes, I'm making friends. <laughs> If I win $10,000 cash, I'd like to say that I put it towards my hex debt, but we all know that I'm just going to walk straight into a makeup store and buy my makeup, let's be real here. Yeah. If I win the face awards, you guys are going to need to have like a stretcher on deck because I am actually going to pass out. Like, I can't deal if I win. I'm still celebrating making top 30, so... Give me such beauty within, for to change who she was would wipe away such a grin. Good things come to those who wait, spreading peace and love to dispel the hate. Please welcome Jacob Stella. Look at that highlight. Jacob, how does it feel to be top six? Much like what Nadia was saying in her video, I didn't think I was going to make it to the top 30. So the fact that I'm standing here in the top six is absolutely incredible. <laughs> Lara, what made you get into the makeup, particularly special effects? Uh, I think I really like a challenge, and if I saw it, I wanted to do it. And probably I have this real deep-seated want to have horns and teeth, and so <laughs> this seems like the right way to go about it. Yeah. <laughs> Something that you might not know about me is that I've only just started to get into body paint and special effects since last year. My favourite challenge has been the Dreaming in Candy one because I got to do two different looks for that and build a whole set and... Hey, you girl. Hey, baby girl. Hey. Hey, hey, baby. I feel like we've spent all night clapping for other people coming up. We need to clap oh, for Jack. Oh, stop. Is she killing it? Please, <laughs> This is about you. <laughs> hey, how are you tonight? Tell us about your experience with the US Face Awards uh, last year. Look, honestly, it was absolutely incredible. Yep. And I mean... You know, we all know that the Face Awards isn't just about technical artistry and skill. It's very much about, you know, self-empowerment yes. and confidence and expressing yourself and expressing uh, expressing your creativity and art and all of those amazing things. And to see all of that, like, realised in the US yeah. was just absolutely incredible. The passion and the screaming and, oh, it, I was so lucky to even get to experience that. I've got to yeah. tell you, it was just, it was incredible. Mm -hmm. I am just absolutely blown away. All the six of you are absolutely incredible. The 30 finalists, amazing. You guys are just as good, if not better, than the US <laughs> talent. And everybody's like, oh, all hail the US and all the rest of it. We are killing it. Yeah, we are here. We are yeah. here. <laughs> as a very successful beauty vlogger. Oh, stop it now. No, she, she's amazing. Can you please give our contestants one piece of advice once their journeys are finished with the face award? Yeah, look, I think... YouTube's a, it's a very difficult climate um, at times and, you know, we're exposed to a lot of criticism and a lot of things going on and whatnot. 
But honestly, I tell everybody that I meet that is in this industry that you have to just be yourself. It doesn't matter what you're doing, who you are working with, you know, even the content that you are doing. If you embrace who you are as an individual, you will be successful because, you know, people connect with your personality, they connect with who you are. And if you are, you know, I, I don't know, saying like pretending to be something that you're not um, and you're not embracing who you are personally, it's just not going to come off the same. Just be you. You're fabulous because you are who you are. You're an individual because you are who you are. You gotta be yourself, and if you are yourself, you will kill it. Amen to that. I feel like this industry is so saturated, oh, but, what it they, is. but what they don't have is you. That's yeah. all you've got, you know. Be yeah. you. There's oh. only one of you in the whole world. Thank you so much. Why would you be someone else? Thank you so much for joining me. Please go to Nikia. Claire Howell. Are you ready to help me announce the winner? Let's do it! Let's do it! Let's do it! Let's do it right now! Yes! In front of everyone! What are we talking about? <laughs> okay, we're going to start off with the first award, which is storytelling. And the award for storytelling goes to Nadia! <laughs> Production all goes to Lara! <laughs> For inspiration, and the winner of the inspiration award goes to Bon Bon. Yeah. I'd like to announce. Are you guys ready? Yeah. The first face awards, Australia and New Zealand <laughs> beauty vlogger of the year is. goodness I literally just got out of the place and I was on my way to the car and I was on the phone with my sister and I realized wait a minute where's the car key I left my bloody purse in the auditorium thank God shout out to you Renee thank you so so much for picking it up literally <sighs> thank you Renee you're a lifesaver thank you I'll talk to you in the car it's kind of weird holding camera up on the street I'm just so happy that I was able to attend the first ever Nick's face award event so that is that is amazing even though like i didn't stay around and talk to people i didn't you know i wasn't really social you know what i mean that's because i'm really anxious okay like today was just a whirlwind starting from yesterday and i've just been really really anxious about this and i'm always anxious when i'm going to a new place and i don't know anyone so i, I know and I'm the first one to say it that I let my anxiety get the better of me today but at the same time I, I'm still proud of myself for going because usually I would have just not attended I would have just stayed home you know so yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog I'm going home now and there's nothing else to show you guys so I hope you enjoyed this vlog I hope you enjoyed the little the performances in there and whatever you do Remember to love yourself and also try to be yourself. I don't know what my self is at times, but anyway. And it was really good seeing Nikia Joy on stage today. She's, I love her. I follow her on Instagram and Snapchat and YouTube and 
it was really nice to hear that little inspirational inspirational talk she gave thank you so much next cosmetic australia for giving me the opportunity to be able to attend this event i really appreciate it and i will try to continue to work on my social anxiety yeah okay bye bye oh, and before we go this is the goodie bag from the event so cute and i just picked up these drinks because i wanted to give it a try i just picked up these drinks on my way out you know i'm not staying but i'm gonna pick up a drink this really intrigued me because it's chai water and i love chai seeds so so in here we have oh you do know that i've always wanted something like this same because i would see it in people's videos and i'm like that is interesting and it's got nicks at the back of it six times better cleansing than hands alone Oh, Clarisonic. Oh, oh, okay. It's a little. I'm not gonna show you guys that because it's a little coupon code, and I really want that foundation, Clarisonic foundation brush. Oh, that's a little coupon code as well. All right, and next we have. What do we have? I'm still in the car, guys. There's traffic anyway, so I might as well wait. Oh, Porphyla Liquid Eliminator. Oh, Butter Gloss. We've got Blush and Contour Duo. Finishing Powder. Balm. Nice. And look at, look at how cute that setting spray is. The mini setting spray. That's so cute. And in here we have Garnier. Oh, a little something, something nice. Oh, I love my solar cleanser water. I have like three already at home. So great. And we've got BB cream there, which I do have as well, which is kind of weird. It's not my shade, but I have it. And this one, honestly, I don't know if I'm going to open it just because NYX is on it. So we're going to find out. And I believe it's mint. So two mint. Great. And we have a little little bits and pieces in there this is this is one of the sponsors by the way this is um red can hair treatment oh we've got another mint three nice oh four oh five oh six <gasps> maybe i'll open one <gasps> and we've got another hair treatment that's nice oh and my camera cap so that's it oh i really love my nails guys look at that i got it done for the event it's nice and that's it that's really awesome honestly i am this is this is gonna be my very first this is my very first event that i've ever been to very first i mean in australia so actually everywhere else what am i talking about very first so yeah! <laughs>